So, hi guys, this is Charagonable here again, and this is a Manifo battle report that hopefully we'll actually complete this time. <laughs> so this is Neil. Neil is testing out his new Mortimer crew. And this is my mother. Say hi, mother. Hello! <laughs> okay. <laughs> Not Mortimer bit. Crew, it's a Nicodem Crew. Okay, sorry, Nicodem Crew. <laughs> Mortimer's in it, give me a break. So, tell me what you have. Well, we got the punk zombie with the actual punk hair. Yeah. We got my samurai punk zombie and Braveheart punk zombie. Yeah. Then we have Mortimer. Mortimer? He's actually a pretty cool looking dude. Yeah. And he's going to hit everyone with a shovel. Yes. You know, as you do. Go to and then we got the coolest the of them all. Yep, it's Nick probably Nick them. The one with the vulture on his arm. Yep. He's got an awesome top hat. Yes, the top hat. <laughs> and then, what's up here? These are going to be my summon minions if one of your people dies or one of mine dies. Yes. They are known as mindless zombies. We've got Farmer Ted. <laughs> Farmer Ted. You see that? we got Mr. Charlie Chaplin. Yeah. <laughs> Lol. And then we've got Servant Girl. Yep. Dead Maid. Yes. And if you want to know, I assembled these last night, put a black wash on them. That's why they're not painted. That's why over, they look. And then over here, we have my crew. We have Lilith. That's with toast. What was that? Yeah, there's toast cooking. <laughs> if only you could smell it, YouTubers. <laughs> anyway, so we got Lilith with her totem, the Manifold Cherub. We have a Lelu, which I'm testing out for the first time in game. Got Blackwood Shaman and three Terratops. That is likely to die pretty quickly. They are. They always die very quickly because you get a really good luck <laughs> against the Blackwood Shaman. Against the Blackwood Shaman. Hopefully he won't die if I can actually do something with him. So there's my card. That's his card. This is the terrain setup. We have battery with river, bridge, and then river snaking along there. And we don't have we don't have excess terrain, so we do that. So uh, move on. So we'll draw our hands and get back to you when we activate. I know. So Neil is going first. And his first action is to eat some toast. <laughs> okay, so it's my go now. <laughs> <laughs> I will be going soon, YouTubers. So I'll just go eat his toast. Okay, we'll get back to you after. Okay. Okay, now he's going. He's going. Ah. That's his hand. Actually, I know. But I'll show you choose my hand. Okay, that's my hand. And then, if you want, you can show me your hand. Wait, hang on a sec. Can you get that? Ha ha. <laughs> yes, I, I already know your hand's better than mine, because it always is. Okay, so, who, who are you going to activate first? Got to be honest, I don't quite know. <laughs> yeah, this is the first time playing this then, by the way. That's why I don't know. Um, right, let's have a think this, shall we? I think, mm. just for the sole Easy. purposes of doing this, okay. I'm going to activate the punk zombies first. Okay, which punk zombie? I'm the, the actual punk, punk yeah. zombie. The punk punk. The punk punk. This dude. And I'm going to walk him. Okay, you're going to walk him. Take measures right there. Yep. Whoop. I'm going to walk him four inches. Four inches. Which is one, two, three, four. Okay. And then? And then walk him near the river, but four inches away. Alright, so I'm at four, let's say. Okay, great. So like there. There. And then flop, 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 flop. Okay. So he shall wait there. My okay. Oh, no, I should get back to some toes. Yes. Okay, so now it's my turn. So, what I'm going to do is... I'm going to activate... Blackbird Charm first. No, first I'll eat some toast. Thank you. Mmm, lovely. Uh, back in a bit. Seems that one where you got a like, I don't know what it's called now. It's like death after death or something. Something like that. Yeah. So, so this game is death after death, and if you don't know what it is, look it up in the rule book, you lazy bastard. <laughs> my scheme is a frame for murder. Here, I have to try and get Lilu killed by Nicodem. By specifically Nicodem or by? By specifically Nicodem. By an opposing master. Um, so I'm technically doomed. Yeah, because the punk zombies are going to kill you. Yeah. yeah I know that. Bother. Yes, we're eating toast. Okay, so what I'm going to do for my activation is I'm going to walk the Blackbird Shaman. Who's going to walk five. And then, whoops, walk five. And then he's going to activate Blood in the Air, which 
if I recall correctly. <laughs> Thank you. Which is an 8 inch pulse. Friendly Nephilim may push up to 4 inches towards this model. So I'll get back to you when I've done that. I wasn't sure I was recording for any of that. <laughs> but anyway, uh, that's what happened after my go. So, you'll go. Right. So he's literally just walking forward. Done. <laughs> okay. There's not much I can do at the moment. True. True. <coughs> okay, so now it's my go. And uh, I'll eat the rest of the toast. Okay, so it was just my turn. I completely forgot to record it. I activated Lilith, companioned uh, the cherub, and then used Broodmother to activate the Lilith too as well. I tried to cast Transposition with Lilith from Lelu and uh, this punk zombie, and it failed. I burned Soulstone and it still failed. So I used the Cherub to try and companion to, to Transposition Lelu and this punk zombie. Uh, that failed as well. Uh, so I, in the end, just literally just went down over there. So, uh, you'll go because I have shocking luck. <laughs> <laughs> I do. Every single time I try to cast Transposition, it has failed. I need to console myself with some toast. <laughs> You only really use most of your people. You've only got Teratops to use now. Yeah. And I've still got most. <laughs> oh. Yes, I'll go. Yeah, yeah. Um. Probably walk again now. <laughs> okay, so, let me guess. The last punk zombie. For that. Now, do I want to self mutilate or do I not want to self mutilate? Don't self harm. Ha <laughs> 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 ha! Just down to check the range. One foot. Bing, bing, bing. You can actually reach that one, bitch. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's why I wanted transposition to work. <laughs> right. Now, because I'm more likely to be able to summon these thingy mobs, the quicker these things die. Uh huh. <laughs> so, I'm going to self mutilate myself, but I get to try and actually be able to cast it. And it costs 12. And you are casting. And casting four, which is really bad. So, oh. hmm. Mm -hmm. Right. Boom, fail. Ah. Now, do I want to cheat? Do I not want to cheat? You know what? I'm saving the cheats for later. Oh. But boom, because that only costs one, I can probably do it again. <laughs> do you want to do it again? I may as well try. <coughs> mm -hmm. Boom. Nah, <laughs> red yoga. Now I can definitely do it. Okay. <laughs> So, I need to try and resist that. Mm -hmm. No, actually, no, you flip, you inflict the wounds before you try and cast it, don't you? I don't know. Read the card again. Mm -hmm. Inflict up to three wounds on this model before choosing a target. Ah, okay. Target model suffers one wound per wound. Does it have a resist? Defense. Hmm, okay. Okay, how many wounds are you going to fit on yourself? Three. Three. The full three wounds. You're not bothering to resist it, then. Oh, no, I'm resisting it, but you have to choose... You have to inflict wounds before you choose yeah, the target, don't you? Go ahead. Okay, so, now I have to resist. So what's it again? Red Joker plus four. Red... So that's 18. Lilith has defence eight, so I only need a ten. So... That's an ace. I'm going to choose it. Use it. Grab my hand. Do you remember this hand from earlier? Do you remember it? I'm going to use. Uh, da, da, da. I'm not going to use Yabs to try to defend. Well, I've played against it often enough. I'm going to use this card. Nice, actually, all cheated, that's there. So I've cheated that. I've resisted. Wow. I'll just heal it when they can do it. Yeah, okay. Anyway, so um, now it's my go again. Okay, so my go, I took the top from here, sprinted it up there, and then failed to sprint it but moved it up there anyway. So, uh, his go. <laughs> oh, his go. Yes, I refer to you as Hin now. You don't have a name. You're activating Mortimer. No, I'm checking Mortimer. Checking Mortimer. I'm not quite activating him. <laughs> he is this dude. Doom with the epic shovel of doom. And uh, if you want to know, he's already used his red joker this go. Mm-hmm. All right, I might... Oh, and wait, wait. Stop, press. I need my toast. <gasps> Goodbye. I think I'm going to cast Exhume. Exhume! Which well, what gives a corpse count, doesn't it? Yep. Okay, so you want to Exhume somebody? I need to be able to cast it first. Yep. What do you need for it? Twelve. Well, you got seven. 
and he's got cast in five, so that's twelve. Ah. <laughs> and now I need a crow. I need to flip it, see if it's a crow. No, it's not. What? Don't, don't you need to? Don't you need to see if it's a seven and a crow? Don't you need the same card? No, it says flip a fake card from the top of your fake deck if the card is a crow. Place one corpse counter. Ah, okay. So it's. I was just checking. I was just checking. Cast it then. Then flip another card. Okay. Yeah. Can you cheat that? Yep. Okay. And let me guess, you have got a crow there somewhere. Yes, I have. The same way I haven't got a mask in my hand at all. And I haven't done for the last three games. And I won't need the crow for more Nicodem even, so... So? Boom! That's quite a high card. Ah, oh, well. Right, so that gives me one corpse counter. Okay. Which we'll need to find something for. Yes, we do. A penny, perhaps. Uh, okay. Uh, stop press. Find that one. So we've, got, yeah. Yeah. so we've got an improvised corpse counter there as a tuppence. <laughs> oh wait, eight of crows. Eight of crows? Well I've already got the crow now. So I don't well no, don't you have to flip the card anyway? Probably. And it's yeah. two. <laughs> so that's So you have another crow in your hand? Nope. Okay. Well that's the Teratops. Yes, I can either move Teratops or Teratops. And I think I'll move Teratops. I'll move uh, this Teratops. Muffin! Ah! Attack of the giant muffin. Uh, <laughs> Okay, so I'm going to move this Teratot. I'm going to try and cast Sprint. Which fails, but uh, he gets to move five inches anyway. Damn you and your crows. Yeah. Eh, okay, sorry. It's hard opening a tape measure with one hand, so he's going to sprint five inches. And tape measure's going to fall over. And then I'm going to try and cast Sprint again. Another crow. I'm rubbing it in your face now. <laughs> okay, so he's just going to sprint another five inches. At least we know I have plenty more crows in the deck. <laughs> yep, okay, so that's my activation. So for a zero cost item, one minor zombie has been summoned. Boom boom. And get the mark man out of the way. Right, what's your next action? Decay to heal my dude. Okay, decay where? Here, around here. Just there, so you're going to target your own dude. To heal him. Okay, so cast it. <laughs> what do you need? Casting, 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 I don't know, I've lost it. Fourteen. Fourteen, and he has casting... You can seven. Have seven, okay, so you need a seven. Boom! Of crows. Ah. Okay, so that's casted on there. So he's hit by that, so he heals two wounds. Mm-hmm. So Braveheart Zombie, where is he? He's that card. So flip him over, rubbing off two marks. Doesn't he have to do I don't have to flip it to see if the blast is activated as well? Uh, well, there's no point because no one else is damaged. Well, he's healed two wounds anyway, so Okay, that's so right. go on, rub it off. Oh, yes. card. It, 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 it. Two wounds, Gion. I think I'd actually accidentally move one of you guys forward. Like there. You haven't actually put the other table these ones. No, I know. I haven't had time. Anyway. Okay. Right, so that leaves so most of his wounds back, so that's fine. So, that's, that's, so he still has two actions? Yep. Two spells, at least. <laughs> Well, two actions, yeah. Well, two actions that can be used on spells, if you so wish. Yeah. Wobbly camera! Oh. Okay, so... Oh. Come on, Neil, behave. You're on YouTube. I'm sorry. <laughs> Bad Neil. Bad Neil. Yeah. Eh. Dice? What? No, the other thing. I couldn't remember what it was called, even though it's a tape measure. <laughs> Honestly. Honestly, how useless am I? Stand over here. <laughs> that, I'm going to try something. Wait a sec. That failed. So I was trying one of those Hitchcock zooms. <laughs> Fail. Yeah, I know. Anyway, come on. What are you doing? Right, I think we Come on, what are you doing? Quickly, come on, come on. Wait, fast, come on. Boom. He's moved there. And then. And then. You can, see, you can see the shadow of the camera. Uh, yeah, bitches. Oh. So there's no point using that yet. What is what are you thinking? Rigor mortis? Yeah. But it just says target from above. Oh, that means it's... Uh, <laughs> well, at least I'm in range to do it next time. <laughs> what, so that's your go? No. Still got one action, yeah. Okay. Come on, quickly. Quickly. You're wasting my time, man. We're two minutes, 43 mi seconds into this clip. Well then, pause it. Okay. What are you going to cast? I'm going to cast the fog. Thank you, Nick, then. Okay, so... It is a aura six, and it's a. Okay, so what do you need to cast it? Skewering. 
Ten. Ten. So you only need what? Three? Oh, that? that failed. So you need a, Oh wait, that didn't fail. I need to bang on that. Because I need the mask as well. Okay. <laughs> so that's exactly the kind you need. Yeah. Okay, so the fog happens. So what does fog do, Neil? It is an aura range six out of every direction and it's height five and it's obscuring for all models, including the ones inside there. Oh, okay. So now Nithin can't see us. So now Nick and you can't see him. Yes. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay. Uh, my go. My la so my last Heritage just sort of sprinted over here. What about close your guys over here? Yeah. That's what this does. Anyway, so uh, this is what the battlefield looks now. My guys are sort of clumped around here, and his guys are sort of there. So, Neil, how do you think the game's going? How do you think the game will go for you? I reckon I will lose. How badly? Pretty badly. This why? is the first time I've used Nicodem. Okay, so why do you think yours? What tactics indicate that? I'm kind of clumped in one corner, whereas you're already charging near me. <laughs> then again, my team can't do that because they're not quick. Hmm, true, Nicodem isn't the fastest guy. He's too busy. Walk. <laughs> and no charge. Yeah. Oh no, wait, sorry, five charges. Really? As if you want to charge with him, though. No, no, no. Okay, so um, from my perspective, I think things might go badly, but I'm not so sure. The only way to find out is to continue charging headfirst into the enemy in a suicidal rush. Which always seems to fail for you, may I add? I know, because I have shitty luck. Yeah, try not to kill your pterodots this time, including... <laughs> I, intend, I intend not to. I <laughs> intend not to. Okay, so, um, so what we do is we discard, no, we shuffle, discard, redraw. Back to you after that. Okay, we're back. We flip finished it. I got an ace for twice in a row, and he got what? What did it get? A eight. Of pros. Eight. Okay, I thought it was a six minute distance, but anyway, he activates first. So who are you going to activate? I don't know. I must say. Mm. Okay, back to you when you've decided. Go. Boom! I'm gonna charge you. Charge me. You got charge. Okay, what? Him? Okay. At. Thingy. Okay, so which means you attack me. With a positive flip, anyway. With a positive flip, okay. So, carry on. So, so I flip for defence. Yes! Boom. So I'll attack him. So, no, yeah. No, they're damn, they're damn melee expert. That's flurry, but never mind. Well, you're charged. No, you have to flip a card. Just because you attacked. <laughs> that would have got me my trigger, too. Yes. Which would have been a double positive flip. Okay, so, um, I win that one. Okay, so now it's uh, my turn. Solstone! <laughs> no, I can't do it, because I'm not in That would okay. be so funny. That, it would be irritated as fuck. <laughs> I'm called the Red Joker. I've just pulled the Solstone. Oh. <laughs> I pull the Solstone, do get 13. <laughs> okay, so, now it's uh, my go. So, just to call what happened. I activated Lilith, Cherub, and Lilith at the same time. Lilith tried to cast Transmission three times and failed every single time. Cherub then tried to cast... Cherub tried to cast it twice, failed every single time. So now you got bored, ran in with Lelu and pwned that punk zombie immediately. While still suffering too, he's in the process. Yes, because he's actually <coughs> supposed to die. Which means he actually gains a blood counter now. So I'll just grab it like a dice or something and... Dice can be blood counters. Dice is a blood counter. Okay. So, um, that's it. And Lelu gained a blood counter. Not 100% sure what to do, if I'm honest now. Well, if I, w if I were you, I'd run in with that other punk zombie. And kill that uh, and kill one of those people. How much wounds Lalo got left? How much wound, How many wounds? He's got uh, six wounds left. <laughs> He's considering it. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I can't do what I wanted to do. Ah, uh, what did you want to do? Run in, use flurry, then use slice and dice three times. Ah. But I can't do it. No, you can't. Because you're not fucking close enough. Eh, eh, eh. Well! This is all going on YouTube. Yeah, I know. Um, 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 uh, uh. I know most of my friends see it. So they're going to see you behaving like this. They're going to do anyway, so, oh well. Exactly. Anyway, 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 anyway. Mm -hmm. Spy cam. <laughs> I can't actually see the screen, so I don't actually know what I'm filming. Damn, I really want the vulture right now. <laughs> well, you don't have the vulture. Get used to it. 
Okay, so I'm gonna stop this filming until you decide. Boom! Now you just go charge in and attack who? Boom! Lelu. Le okay, so. Okay, ready? Mm -hmm. Come on. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> yeah, so I got total defense of. 18. Total attack of 18. Total attack of 18. So that means you get double negative on the flip. Well, my weapon's paired as well. I can't remember what that did. It's like... Uh, well, I, I can't remember. Well, I'm checking. It's, well, it's too late now anyway. So you might as well finish the duel. Especially since you're actually wasting the, the run time on this. Go on. Don't even know <laughs> I apologize beforehand for any mistakes we make. Get used to it. Uh-huh. I've seen it earlier, and I can't find it. How bloody annoying is that? I think it's like, I don't know, uh, positive something? Positive flip something. It's summit summit. I know summit's going <laughs> to happen. It's summit summit. I know summit's going to happen. That's so descriptive. It actually is. Paired weapon. Positive flip, so the one when I was against Lily was meant to have double positive flip, so that's really irritating. Okay. Uh, yeah, so that's a positive flip, so it's just a negative flip. So it's just a negative flip, okay, so that's... Boom, boom, weak damage. Weak damage on Lily, which does, what, two? Two. Two. So that's, uh, doing it on camera is so difficult. Okay. <sighs> that's my turn done, though. Yep, that's his turn done. Okay. So... Right, so I tried to grow my Terratot and I failed twice. So, here's go. Just realised that one's dead, isn't it? <laughs> Pretty much I know, doesn't it? Yes. Um. Boom, I might try and do that. Boom! Can I just have the tape measure? Uh, tape measure, that's this thing. Okay, <sighs> so what are you doing? <sighs> I'm in range. With any of them. Yeah. So what? You, wait. What are you doing? You'll see. <laughs> no, I no. I want to know what you're doing, and the camera wants to know what you're doing. Decay. Decay. Okay. Right. So let's try and cast this then. Okay. Mm -hmm. You gotta try and resist with willpower. Okay, with willpower. Mhm. Okay. Nine the crows. Is that what you needed? Yep. Yep, okay, so that cast. Who are we casting it on, by the way? It doesn't matter if it gets a blast. Yeah, but you need to cast it on someone. One. That one. That the one. Top. The Terratot. Okay, so, uh, I need to resist with them. I need to resist with the Terratot. With willpower. With willpower. He has willpower five. So you got casting total of? Uh, nine plus seven. Sixteen. So you need eleven. Eleven. So I need an eleven. I got ten. So I'm going to cheat with a... This is so hard to do with one hand, you know. Twelve. I don't know if I can cheat this, can I? Well, it's a bit late anyway. Because you cast a spell now. I thought I could cheat. Oh, I don't know how you could cheat. No, when you cast a spell, you cast it and then do your cheating while you're casting. What the fuck? I think. And then I have to resist. That makes no sense, because you don't do that when you're using melee. I know, because melee is actually hitting someone. With casting more. <laughs> yes, with casting someone, you cast a spell, send it to someone, and they have to resist it when it hits them. Just yeah, that's the same with melee. You hit, the, you go for it, they try and, and then they. Yeah, with melee, you can try and hit them again. You can't cast a spell immediately afterwards unless you're really clever. <laughs> it's just the rules. How do you know this? I'm gonna lock this up. <laughs> Feel free. This is completely from memory, and I'm pretty sure I'm not far out. <laughs> I was given up. So, Neil, what did you try to do? Cast a K three times, and because of the stupid rule where you can't actually cheat once you've casted it, unlike you can with melee, then I couldn't actually cheat it. Well, you can cheat. You just have to cheat before. Why cheat before if you don't know what? You can't cheat something beforehand because you don't yes, know you what can. you're going if to get. Well, that's the point. You don't know what you're going to get. Yeah, so you, you know get with right. melee. What? You know with melee. Well, yeah, with melee, you actually see the person. Oh, just shut up. Okay. So basically, he cast it one time, it got low card, I cheated. 
He cast second time, got the card I cheated. Cast the third time, I had no cards to cheat with, and I got the 13. I'm pretty sure it's something like that. I know that if I've got it wrong, then he will punch me in the face. Yeah, he will. Yes. It's just a game. Not if the rules get bended. <laughs> bended. The word's bend. Okay, I'm going to pause the video. spell effects till later. Okay, I'm going to cut the video here. Okay, for my go, the Blackwood Shaman uh, moved up there to the bridge, uh, used um, that blood in the air thing which moved everyone towards him, then tried to cast a Blood Frenzy, but that failed. So, now it's a Neil Go who's still pondering the point of that casting thing. This is just confusing me because I don't see how it works. As you said. Mm -hmm. So, okay, I'll get back to you when you've decided what to do. Okay, so what are you doing? Exhuming twice, I'm Mortimer. Okay, so. Alright, so it's casting cost 12, he's got casting 5, so only 7. seven. Well, that failed. That failed. So, you're going to cheat? Yeah, may as well. Got okay. it. Okay, so we'll Oops. get another ki we'll get another counter soon. Cast the other one. Um, next one. Well, that failed, but I can't be bothered. <laughs> okay, so you because get there's a corpse counter over there. And if I can get to that, then that's all Master Zombies anyway, isn't it? Yep. So uh, your turn. Yep. Uh, okay. So back in a bit. Okay, back in my go. I tried to grow this Nephilim and failed again. So um, back to you. Okay. So what are you doing? Self-mutilate. Okay, with classes. which? With with what? Uh, this punk zombie here. Is, that, is he in range? I think so, it's 12 inches. 12 inches? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that's in range, fair enough. Whoa, I was just checking, I wasn't sure. Uh, resist with defence, not willpower. Okay. Wait, how much defence has the leader got? Uh, five. Five, okay. So it's all, uh, it's okay. Slightly above average. Yeah. Okay, so. Um, no, it's so you need an eight to cast. Yeah, it'll lead to fucking I think. Oh, fucking hell. Six, not good. Six, so you cheat that. Is yeah. it? Ten, so that's what? Fourteen. Fourteen, so five and fourteen, I need a nine. In nine. There's got six. Flip, flip, flip. There's ten. Okay. I'll try again then. I'll try again. That failed. Okay, so that's 11. So that's a total of something stupid. 15. 15, okay, and so I got 5. Okay, we've had a slight incident. Uh, Neil was so mad at that um, casting dispute we had that um, he actually stormed off in a huff. So what I've actually done is grabbed someone off the street who, and got him to impersonate Nicodem for us. So um, here he is. Hi. Good day. Good day, sir. Uh, have you ever played Madison before? I have indeed. I'm one of the masters. Of course. So um, let us start. So I shall so wait, no. First we have to shuffle our decks back in. So let's do that presently. Okay, Nico, we have shuffled our decks, we have drawn our cards. So I shall show the kind viewers on YouTube my hand. There you go. That is Joker. I'll leave you to guess which one. Very well. And then I shall sweep the camera around. Like that. Very well. And this is the battlefield as we left it. So, uh, let us begin. We shall flip for initiative. I believe that means I go first. For the first time in this game. Too blue. So, Nikodem, I shall now recap what happened in my turn. Okay. What happened was, Lilith successfully transpositioned Linitu with this punk zombie. So this punk zombie and Linitu is now over there. And then the cherub cast the power of love onto the transpositioned punk zombie. So he cannot make strikes this turn. And now Lenu is proceeding to do what he does best and go into a berserk rage at Nicodem. I apologise considerably. I do not accept your apology. We shall see about that. Transposition? Yep. Okay, so Nicodem, as you can see, I did not in fact once wound you. That's because I have a lot of defence when needed. Yes, in the form of your valuable soul stones. Indeed. Don't worry, they'll run out soon enough. I still got four. 
They will run out soon enough if you don't deal with Lewis who there. Well, you're standing right next to Mortimer. And Nick Odell. Yes. I see only one thing for it. We shall see you next turn. It is your go now. Please commence your turn. I am going to use Mortimer. And what I shall do is first I think I will quite honest I don't know but <laughs> yeah, I didn't know we could do that um, anyways I'm going to attack you you're going to attack Lily too Lily Lily I apologise profusely with melee attack with my shot of course right so here yeah. Lip I have defense of 11. I have attack of 18. 18, therefore I shall attempt to cheat. Though quite honestly I do not know what I shall cheat with. In fact, I do not think I can cheat high enough. Mm -hmm. That's seven so, That's wait, 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 wait. I shall cheat to yep. an 11. Which means you only win by one, I believe. Or in, in fact, do you? Two. Two. Okay. Um, which means it's a negative flip. I don't believe he actually has an effect that stops that. So. A seven and a five, so weak damage. Weak damage. With two. Two. Okay. And now one is going to consider attacking you once again with melee. And is one done considering? Yes, I'm going to attack you once again. Okay. I have a defense. Oh, we we both drew we both drew the nine of masks. That is quite creepy. Indeed, but I have a defense of five at nine, which is fourteen. I have the attack of. This is the fifteen. Fifteen. So you win by one. Mm-hmm. Shall I bother cheating that? I have nothing to cheat it with anyway. Do carry on, good sir. That is weak. That is, is it a negative flip? So either way, it's weak anyway. So it is weak damage. Which is another two damage. Another two. Very well. How much wounds have you got left? Two. That means after this activation, you're dead. Yes, if you don't attack me with Nick then, to get rid of me further. I believe it's your go. Indeed it is my go. I shall see you soon. So, in my go, I activated my Black Blood Shaman, who walked along to pick up the corpse counter in the middle of this group, and who then caused blood in the air and attracted all the young towards him, and then injected the blood he obtained from the corpse counter into the unfortunate samurai punk zombie. But then what did the punk zombie do to him? The punk zombie retaliated because of um, slow to die. And I managed to hit a severe damage, henceforth doing five damage on him. Yes, which means he only has three wounds left. Which isn't good. Some zombies need to learn proper manners. Indeed they do. Nick them, you're smiling. Hmm. Why? Well, for this turn, what I did was use my decay move on the Blackboard Shaman, which was positioned here. I hit it. It caused severe damage, and with decay, that means a five blast. Ergo, once this has happened, this had killed off two Teratots, the Blackwood Shaman, and also the Cherub. Once I had done this, obviously because of my trigger, this summoned three mindless zombies into place. Why not more? Hmm? Why not more zombies? Because I don't actually have them. <laughs> Therefore, once that was only one move, I once again used K and attacked Lilith instead. This time I did severe damage again, but it was five and a blast. Unfortunately, though, Lilith had six health left, so she's on one health. I tried casting decay once again, but unfortunately that failed because he got lucky. Are you both going? Yes, we are. We're filming.
speed, uh, turn it off and him, charge in, try to attack the zombie and fail. Okay, end of round battle report. How do you think this round went? I thought this round went exceptionally well for me. I have to agree with you. There's only one of my guys left. <laughs> He's terror tot. Yes. Surrounded by four people. Yes. I think you I think you won. I think I pretty much won. Oh, and uh, just to clarify, Lelu, because there isn't a Lelu 2 on the board, suffers three wounds at the end of each round, and he only had two left. So he died. Anyways. So. Uh, flip for initiative. Quickly. Two. Seven. Seven. So you go first. I go first. Charge. Oof. Yes, thank you for destroying the river. Sorry. Charge. Charge. Run zombie. Go quick. Defense. Go you get 16 defense. <laughs> I only get a measly. No, wait, you get plus, because you charged. Oh. Positive. Oh, there we go, that's better. 17. 17, and I got 16. Fuck you. I'm going to let that one go. Alright, so that's one attacks. Yes. Nick, I didn't know you had a phone. <laughs> this is... Th this isn't a phone, this is a brick. <laughs> okay, anyway. so... You get, so you win by one. I win by one. Which I is a negative flip. I didn't get my trigger, but it's paired, so it's a straight flip. Straight flip. Which happens to be that. Can I cheat the damage? Uh, yes, because it was straight flip. You can Severe. Severe. Which kills. Which he's dead. End of game. Is it? How do you think the game went? No, wait a sec. I'll stop this video. Well, the thing is, Nicodem has just disappeared now. Nicodem's... Oh, hi, Neil. What the fuck? Yeah, um, when you charged off, uh, someone dressed as Nicodem came in and played the game for you. And I won. Yeah, you won. Sweet. You won quite badly. So, I won't ask you how the game went, because you weren't here for most of it, but how did the game go up to you when you stormed off? Awful. Yes, well, um, this person was obviously a lot better at playing than you, so, um, he sort of, um, Hey, this won. is my first time playing <laughs> as Nicodem. I know, I know. Oh, but still, this person, I think you should also try and meet that person, because he, he used him quite effectively. Oh, okay. Yep. And as for me, um, I sort of died a lot. Oh dear. What happened? Mm. Well, basically, um, this person, I charged up, I had all my guys across around here, and he cast Decay on these guys, and basically killed all of them. Oh! In three turns. And there's still corpse counters everywhere. I know. Right? There's all my guys. Bloody hell. Yeah. I've been out to summon loads. I know. Okay, we gotta go. So, uh, bye YouTube.